So I went ahead and I took off all of the interior paneling from the side, the passenger side of the truck, because we ran the camera wire down the frame of the vehicle all along the side, connecting all the way through the tailgate where we have our camera that comes with the display review mirror mounted with a little bit of silicone on top of the brake light. So all of that camera wiring is connected and ran through the truck along that side. Down the driver's side is where we ran the power line straight into the fuse box. This is my first time doing an install like this. So my husband has been guiding me through the process through the entire way and of course helping me when I needed it. Um, there are some pictures I inserted here to just kind of show you where the wires are running along the side of the truck. We did have to remove the panel that contains the airbag because we had to gently move some of that out of the way so we could take down that overhead panel that contains all of the electrics for our mirror setup. And we put everything back just as it was <laughs> for safety, of course. Um, once we got the upper passenger side panels uh, and the driver side panels off, the that entire section of upper paneling and casing came off really easy. It's uh, pressure clips. It uh, wasn't really hard for me to do. The rear display mirror at night. No glare, so it's a lot easier to see. It's like having a little television in the car. <laughs> Thank you. So super clear, it's a lot clearer in person, but you know, video, trying to get video. And again, if I turn it off, it's just a, hello, regular mirror. Okay, some cool features, you can tap on it, you can take pictures, record. Uh, one thing, the microphone is constantly recording, so that's a neat little feature. Um, I guess playback. And then you can flip the different views that it has the different angles. So pretty cool stuff. Maybe see about getting one if you like this too. It's very helpful, honestly, the rear views. I've been driving around today with it and um, I like it a lot.